Americans, let me give you a super quick rundown of gun laws in Canada so you can be happy yours are better. We had three mandatory gun registries, non-restricted, restricted, and prohibited. The non-restricted one thankfully was abolished, which is most 22s and basic rifles and shotguns. Restricted is every handgun, AR-15, and the like, so the government tracks everything to each person and home. Prohibited ones could only be owned if you owned them when they were made illegal, but can't be used or sold or anything like that. Every single handgun must have a permit to even take it from your home, and only for acceptable uses, which are the gun range and having it repaired. Everything else is illegal. Now they've just recently outlawed 1,500 previously legal guns through government dictate, no laws were passed, and are mandating their buyback. Essentially, they'll steal it from you, give you less than market value, and put you in jail and take your other guns if you don't comply. They're also banning all handguns, pretty much, by banning their purchase, transfer, and importation. So you can keep what you have, for the moment, but that's it. And anyone who uses a gun in self-defense is frequently put in jail. The government seems to put the lives of criminals above those of law-abiding citizens. In fact, you're not even allowed to purchase a gun for that reason, only hunting and target shooting. So Americans, please cherish your gun rights and fight hard to keep them and expand them. Ours have been destroyed over many decades here in Canada. Here, the far-left liberal politicians are trying to take everything from us, and they're succeeding, because our conservative politicians are spineless liberals in disguise, and most of the country lives in too much comfort to realize what's really being taken from them.